tutorial, I am going to show you a little bit about Canva. It is great for creating graphics and editing them, and it makes them look very professional, very simply, and very easily. So if you just go to canva.com, it's C-A-N-V-A dot com, uh, you can sign up for a new account. Uh, you can use your Google account or Facebook account or sign up with an email. So I'm just going to use my Google account, and uh, that will pop up. Um, as my Spartan Docs. And then this is your layout. These are the ones that you've already created. And it's free to use, but you, there are some advantages to upgrade. But for the most part, just use the free version. So you can create a design. Just click this little button right here. And you can um, just click something here if you want, or use custom dimensions. But I'm just going to click create a design. Uh, all of this, all of these different options appear and you would just select something. So if you wanted to create some type of poster, you would click on the poster one. Once that pops up, this is how everything looks. So you can choose a layout. So I'm just going to choose, let's say, that one. So a little picture in the background, reservation, and so on. Um, so layout is the first option. Then you want to go down to elements. And this gives you free photos. So if you want free photos, maybe put something in the background. These are great photos to use. Maybe put that there. They get a totally different feel. Um, grids, if you wanted some type of grid, then you just click on the grid. And now you can do maybe make that a little bit smaller. And the advantage of a grid is that it will allow you to put three different pictures in there, or three of the same pictures. So we'll go back to free photos, and I'll choose one, two, three. So there's three different pictures in there. So Abby's class, classy. Frames, same thing as a grid, but more or less just one picture. You do have some cool different options here, something like that, where you drag a photo in and um, now it's sort of like broken up so we'll do this, drag it in there and now I wouldn't use it for that per se but that's just an option, I'm going to click delete to get rid of it so that's free photos, grids and frames, you have shapes which is pretty self-explanatory, you just put a shape in there uh, lines, if you wanted some type of line it's nice to add to the top or the bottom, and you'd probably keep it consistent. Uh, illustrations, hot dog, hamburger, clock, add something there. Icons, yeah, if you wanted some type of truck, at the bottom. Charts, if you wanted charts, and then the I love canvas which is canvas stuff so that's all elements that was a brief overview of elements text if you want text um, you can see there's lots of different free versions for text so here we have Abby's class we can Clavy's classy you can change that fairy tale stories you can take that in and then you can change this, changes it to black, and you can move that around to wherever you want. Again, it's very simple, very easy to use. Background, you could do a background color if you don't have a picture. And then uploads, if you wanted to do your own uploads, you can do upload your own images. And then bah, these images will appear in here, and then you can just drag them into either a frame or in by themselves and then resize them. So um, Again, very simple to use, very easy to use. You can actually add multiple pages if you want. So I can add another page, and now I have two pages, three pages, and so on. Um, and then you want to be, if you want to make this public, you can make it public, or you can download the image right from there, or you can share it. Um, so for um, the sake of a simple example, I'm just going to download this image and we'll download it as a PDF to print it. Or actually, we'll do JPEG. Um, so I'm going to click Download, and now I have a JPEG image in my Downloads folder on my desktop. 
So that's how you get your image and you can use your image however you want. So it's a great tool to use, so I hope you guys use it. Thanks.